Jesus did good. He is not guilty of sin. Jesus revealed God, and he taught the people to obey God. Jesus also taught that all people are sinners. Many religious people did not want to accept that they were sinners. So they were angry with Jesus and they had him arrested. The followers of Jesus ran away. Jesus was mocked by the soldiers and beaten and despised. But Jesus did not resist. This was part of God's plan. Jesus was not only beaten, he was crucified. This was the practice of punishment for criminals at this time. God said the death of Jesus was the sacrifice for our sins. Jesus took the punishment for our sins when he died. If we sincerely say that we are sinners and turn away from our sins, and believe in Jesus, we will be forgiven by Jesus, of our sins. Do we believe what God says? After Jesus died on the cross, they buried his body in the cave of his friend. A large rock was used to close the cave door, and it was guarded by soldiers, so no one would steal his body. Three days later, some of the women followers of Jesus went to the tomb. But he was not there. They saw an angel, and he said to them, Jesus is alive. He is not here. The angel suddenly disappeared. Jesus was alive and still is alive until now, and listening to us, if we talk to him in prayer. After Jesus was raised from the dead, he was seen by people, including his disciples. Thomas, one of the disciples, said, Unless I can see the wounds in his hands, I cannot believe that he was raised from the dead. In the picture we can see Jesus approaching Thomas, and he showed him his wounds. Then Thomas believed that Jesus was risen and that he was Lord. The Lord Jesus wants us to believe in him, even though we have not yet seen him. Forty days after, Jesus rose from the dead, he invited his followers to a hill. He said, I am going to heaven. When I leave, you have to tell all the people, I died to take the punishment for their sins. Every person who believes in me will have forgiveness of their sins and will be in heaven forever. And I will send my spirit to help you. And they saw Jesus go up to heaven. Then two angels said to the followers of Jesus, One day the Lord Jesus will come back again. This is what the angels said, and they disappeared from sight. Jesus also said he would return, so that they may be taken to heaven and live with him there. If you believe in Jesus now, you can go to heaven, too. The cross reminds us of the death of the Lord Jesus. He did not sin, but was ready to be crucified and die on the cross for us. Thus he died to take 
the punishment for our sins. After he died, the Lord Jesus rose from death. He is willing to help all those who follow him. If we repent and believe in the Lord Jesus, our sins will be taken away. His Holy Spirit will help us to obey God, and He will be with us in heaven forever. Jesus said there are two roads, a wide road and a narrow road. Every man starts on the wide road towards punishment. This leads to the fire that never dies. Any believer who follows Jesus will have a chance to go down the narrow road. The narrow road is towards life with God. Do you want to believe in Jesus? Tell him, Lord, I declare to you that I am a sinner. I believe you died on the cross to take the punishment for my sins. Jesus, forgive me and cleanse my heart that I may live with you. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. If you say this to Jesus from your heart, you will be a child of God and God will be your father. Thank you.